Tomorrow, closing arguments begin in the murder trial for William McCullen. NBC Charlotte has brought you extensive coverage of the trial since it started. McCullen is uh, accused of killing his girlfriend's daughter, three-year-old Jordan Dumont, in Gaston County. This is back in 2016. NBC Charlotte's Ruby Durham joins us with what we can expect this week. Tomorrow in Cleveland County, the state and defense will present their closing arguments, and then the case will be left in the jury's hands. It will be up to the jury to decide if McCullen is guilty or not. In August 2016, investigators made a gruesome discovery. Little Jordan Dumont's body was found buried just a few hundred yards away from her Bessemer City home. Jordan's mother's boyfriend, William McCullen, was supposed to be watching the three-year-old, but told investigators the toddler disappeared when he fell asleep. But after Jordan's body was discovered, McCullen was arrested and charged with first-degree murder. Is why. Tell me why. Tell me how you could do it to a three-year-old innocent child. Those events happening almost two years ago. Now a verdict in William McCullen's murder trial could come as early as tomorrow. During week one of the murder trial, we've heard a graphic testimony from the officer who first discovered the toddler's body and video of the moment McCullen appearing to confess to the murder while he was being interviewed by Gasson County police detectives. At first, I didn't want to go straight to sleep. I didn't want to be in the kick cat and stuff. She didn't want to eat. Didn't want to do nothing, and I just got mad. Jurors also got to see the clothes little Jordan was wearing when she was killed and photos from the crime scene. This along with information as to how Jordan died from a medical examiner who performed Jordan's autopsy before prosecutors rested their case. Right now, William McCullen faces first degree murder charges, but tomorrow we could learn a verdict as to what's going to happen next. So be sure to tune in to WCNC on air and online as we work to learn more details. We will be at the courtroom tomorrow in Cleveland County and we'll let you know exactly what happens. For NBC Charlotte, Ruby Durham, back to you in the studio.